Hi, and welcome to Dog Intervention. I'm Big Chuck McBride, and I help dogs with behavioral issues. Today, I'm here with Nicole Beach from Last Day Dog Rescue, and she has a couple of issues she may need help with. So hang on to your hats and come along for the ride. This is Dog Intervention, and I'm Big Chuck McBride. Now, this is tricky because you want to make sure you go out first. Right. So you want to move a little more quickly and abruptly. Okay. So we calm down. Okay. You can hand me another one. When they're quiet, some cases you just walk right by. Right. But in this case, it was so much barking, we just wanted to make them stop and be calm around another dog. Know. And then that lets them know, oh, my pack leader has it. Okay? So let's move forward. And we move briskly. Okay, stop. Well, as you can see, we completed our group walk. It's a little bit more in-depth than what I thought. <laughs> I'm probably going to need some tissue when I get in the house but uh, to wipe my face. But uh, I think we did pretty good. So what we want to do is we want sure. to modify the walk. We want to start off with the three easiest dogs, then take one more difficult dog, then put the more difficult dog back in, and then take the next difficult dog. And let's do it that way from now on. Okay. Okay. We're yep. going to give you a two-week plan so you know exactly yep. what to Sounds do. Good. But did you understand how important it was to make sure that the dogs were calm before yes. they left the house? Because if they're not calm when they leave, they're not going to be calm when they walk. That's right. Excellent. I wish all the clients were like that. 